place where the past is present. Stone and metal reminding us of that. Names like Little Round Top, not forgotten. One of the bloodiest days of the war. In Gettysburg, Pennsylvania, time has a way of pausing. You can see it on Carlisle Street at the Majestic Theater. Yes, if these walls could talk to you. The small theaters were the social life of the community. Movies here still run, now on two screens. Hi, how are you? 7.50 a feature. They offer an opportunity for people to discuss culture and issues that are of our time. History, romance, music. And they come with a plot twist or two. The thought of having to replace two perfectly fine and almost brand new 35 millimeter projectors with uh, new digital projectors, it's just financially daunting. Across America, the movies may stop on small town screens. The onset of sound was a big deal. When we converted to color, that was big. But the transition from the technology we use today in the cinemas, which is celluloid film, to digital projection is the biggest transition that we've encountered. Film is fading away. Sometime in 2013, Hollywood will stop shipping it. The movies are going digital. One expensive part of showing movies is transporting heavy reels of film like this. With digital cinema, all you need is something like this, a hard drive. But bits and bytes and new projectors cost money. That's approximately $125,000 for this small town. Five dollars is your change. Okay. And money is hard to come by in the movie showing business, where profits are slim. My gross for film for an entire year is just around $100,000. Will all of the independents be able to survive the transition? No, they won't. And that is, that is unfortunate. So at the Majestic, saving movies means hunting for money. No brainer. I mean, the movies must go on and we will do the fundraising. Hello, Mayor Troxell, thank you for coming out. Memories, perhaps the best pitch of all. I used to carry a flashlight every time I come down this aisle. 85-year-old William Troxell is mayor of Gettysburg. He walked the rows of the Majestic in high school as an usher. As I recall, they had three movies a week. This is before movies on Sunday. And they had to have an election in the area to have movies on Sunday. For now, film still gets threaded. Tickets are sold, drinks poured. There you go. But the future is defeating the past, as it always seems to do. And the screens at the Majestic Theater on Carlisle Street may fade to black. Lee Powell, The Associated Press, Gettysburg, Pennsylvania.